I'm Danny Lottenbarker and I'm the enrichment teacher at Southwest Middle School. And um, we've been doing lead center lobby projects for the last several years, um, highlighting whatever culture the lead center is choosing to highlight for that school year. Uh, I have my kids, my guided studies classes study that culture and um, really kind of based on their interest, choose some topic that they can then um, research in depth and then create something that will teach the lead center patrons about that culture. This right here is the Temple of Artemis. Um, it obviously is in ruin now, um, but it was uh, built and rebuilt like three times um, because people didn't respect it. And it was at one point rebuilt into a church but now it just lays in complete ruin. Um, it's always a great project for the kids because they get to really dive into a culture and learn as much as possible about it, but then also they have the opportunity to have a real live audience for their work. Lots of times kids in school do things and then the teacher sees it and then it goes away. And uh, this is cool because they have the whole Lawrence community checking out their work and actually the artists who are inspiring the work get to see it, which is really cool. Um, it's the Grand Bazaar, which is in Istanbul, and it has a lot of different things inside it. We actually worked pretty hard on the art and all the little things that they're selling, which took a really long time. Um, we decided to do the Grand Bazaar because we thought it was a fun project. It would. It's a huge place, and there's so many tiny little things that went into it. It was tedious, but fun. Yeah. Uh, can you point out some special things, and I'm gonna kinda zoom in on it. Um, okay, well, we have um, the lanterns up there, which have sparkles on them, and it took a really long time, but it was pretty fun to decorate them. We have some pottery. And we have the, um, the eyes, which are like this in real life. And those took a pretty long time too. Well, on the farthest to the left arch, to the left of the arch, there's a picture of a person. And that is Ataturk. He is basically the father of Turkey and the Turkish government that they have today. Um, well, Lawrence is an amazing community. We do have... Um, you know, in my school we have kids from all over the world, um, in, in all of our schools really. Um, and so it's important for us to be really inclusive of all of those cultures. Even though we're in the Midwest and there's kind of a stereotype about what the Midwest is, we really do have diversity, but we need the opportunity to highlight it and to teach everyone about it so that all of our kids are global citizens. So they realize the richness of the cultures around them.